Hello, I'm Peter Jenks, a priest here at St. John's Church in Thomaston. It's hard to know what to do during these, this pandemic time, how to do the services well, how to be, keep everybody safe. It's been a long, long haul with a lot of anxiety. It's important that we take our time and be gentle with ourselves. There have been a lot of changes. I'm finding that things are costing more, taking more time and more stress to being added to our lives in, in little ways that are unexpected oftentimes. But in the midst of this, there are also blessings. God is sur surrounding us with blessings that sometimes we, we miss, sometimes we overlook or take for granted. But the blessings of God have been with us throughout our life. Sometimes we're very aware of them. Sometimes we just go on our own way as if they're not there. But even now, God's blessings are unfolding before us like flowers, like the seasons, like the day. Let us be still long enough to discover these blessings. To understand that blessings sometimes come in very difficult fashion. Sometimes they're not what we want. Sometimes they're so subtle, it's very easy to miss. But the blessings of God guide us and open doors that, that lead us to deeper understandings of love and life and relationship. The blessings of God will continue, even in the midst of anxieties of, of what will come, whether the environment will destroy our, the way of life that we have now, or our finances are challenged, our employment is in question. God's blessings will continue. The love of God is always present. We have been blessed. We are being blessed. And we will continue to be blessed. Just as the sun will rise, just as the air surrounds our, our bodies, so too the relationship of God in our life is ever present. It is this relationship that defines our religion that defines our purpose and blesses us, blesses our memory, our reason, our skills, our very life. May you find the blessings of God in the midst of uncertainty, in the midst of challenges that seem overwhelming sometimes, in the midst of the ongoing threat of this coronavirus, the blessing of God, the blessings of God, the blessings of our life, they are unfolding, unfolding like arms waiting to embrace us. May you feel that embrace today. May you be still long enough to know that you are deeply loved, that in the eyes of God, you are a wonderful, wonderful being. Blessings.